Hello, welcome to Lim Studio. Today we'll be trying to troubleshoot the geyser, the Suntec geyser. Uh, it's not getting hot. So, yesterday we came here. We did put an anti freezer at Lycon, but today there's no results. So, we are trying to, uh, trying to figure out what's the matter here. So, this is the bottom panel. Here's the bottom panel. There's no any heat feeling here. This copper tube doesn't get warm or hot from the bottom panel. So let's feel the ending of the bottom panel and see whether is it tied or not. So this is beneath the geyser, as you can see beneath the geyser. It's cold, this side. So let's go to the top panel and feel it. Here's the top panels. It's getting hotter. It's hot, this one. So we'll take a, a wrench and tighten up. As you can see here, I see some uh, glycon. I think it's been leaking. The telecon has been leaking. Maybe this is the cause. So now we have a first solution. This is suspicious. So I think if I tighten this up, there will be changes. Alright, as you can see my fingers here, they are oily, shiny, glowing. And the other part of uh, the top panel is also hot. Yeah, it's getting warmer. So I will tell my guy here to fetch a wrench so we can tighten up and then check the results from the inside. Uh, Zico, get your wrench please. Uh, I'll pause for now. All right, so now we'll try to tighten it up. This is the, yeah, it's an elbow, Connie's elbow, uh, three quarter by a half inch. So we are tightening it up. Make sure there's no leaks, there's no air going through. Yeah, continue. Let me check. You must make sure always when you tighten a copper tube, you must see a ring from this side. So if you don't see it, then it means you still need to tighten it up. Or so you can do that. All right, looks good. Let's also tighten the other side. Uh, Zico, please come this side and yeah. also tighten the one. All right. Yeah, last ten. Don't be so hard. Alright, that's okay, that's okay. We don't want to cause any damage here. We are fixing.
all right so yeah it works yeah. this is where we can see whether the antifreezer is is in the right level or not is a gauge so through my eye here I don't even see it then I'm trying to figure it out all right so we need to fill some antifreezer the antifreezer is a glycon I'll show you some snapshots over this video so you can understand what I'm talking about this is the this is where the, the hot water outside is an outlet for hot water it's called for now because of uh, uh, the hot water is not yet opened all right right now I will uh, I'll go test inside but all I, I've seen here there's no like horn inside the inside the geyser tank so I will need to feed it but uh, since I've seen I've discovered that the, there's a leak uh, I will uh, put the antifreezer there so it can work all right let me pause it